my channel so today I'm gonna be filming a what I eat in a day pregnancy edition I'm in my third trimester now I will be 32 weeks tomorrow so we're getting close um, so I thought it'd be interesting and fun for you guys to see what I eat in a day I love watching these videos myself and just a disclaimer if you're new to my channel I do not eat very healthy at all those of you that are not new to my channel and have been watching me for a while you already know that but just thought I would throw that out there in case you're clicking into my channel for the first time um, I am thankful that I have a very fast metabolism it's slowed down obviously now that I'm pregnant and getting older I know that once I have Grayson I'm not gonna bounce back like as quickly as I did with Bailey and Shay um, which I kind of I'm hoping for because I feel like that will like push me to actually get my butt in the gym and eat healthy um, because I bounce back so quickly and have a fast metabolism and I can eat whatever I want and I don't really gain too much weight that's why I eat like crap and don't get my butt in the gym because I can get away with it so I know that sounds a little weird but I don't know we'll see how fast I bounce back after Grayson but I'm like kind of secretly hoping that I don't so that I don't know I can work out and eat healthy because yeah it's about time I am almost 28 years old and and it's just about time that I start taking my health seriously so I will keep you guys posted on that but anyways that went off on a ramble quickly um, today's video is gonna be a what I eat in a day so I will show you guys really quick what I'm eating for breakfast but really quick I want to say thank you to home chef for sponsoring today's video I love home chef so much that's the only time I really ever cook um, is when it's a meal from home chef and I don't know which one I want to make for dinner tonight but I'm kind of leaning towards this one the Santa Fe creamy steak penne pasta looks really good Adam will really like that too he'll probably like all of these to be honest but I think this is the one I'm gonna make for dinner tonight it just arrived on my doorstep <laughs> this morning um, so I just finished putting all of the little prepackaged bags in the fridge and um, so they all come in little baggies like this so this is one meal this is another and then this is the third one and then all of the meats for the recipe are packaged separately in this bag which I love so it doesn't like ruin the produce and leak out to everything else um, but I love how everything comes like pre-measured for you in those little bags and this is how it arrives on your doorstep in this little box and there's like ice packs and stuff down there so everything stays fresh so yeah um, this is what I'm gonna be making for dinner tonight. I can't wait. So Shay and I just got back home from dropping Bailey off at preschool and I usually drink pretty much the entire thing of water that I fill up first thing in the morning. <laughs> um, I'm just like so dehydrated lately. So I've been drinking a ton of water. So I usually have like a full cup of this first thing and then I usually won't eat till like 10, 10.30 because I just am not hungry until that point but after we get home and I've played with Shay a little bit then I usually start getting hungry so um, lately I've been having this vanilla Greek yogurt with some peanut butter granola on top a little bit of raspberries I usually do like a handful um, and then I put this agave nectar I drizzle it on top it's really good um, Bailey loves this too she eats this for breakfast all the time and then I'll make my coffee to go with my breakfast as well and lately we've been using um, this blonde roast iced coffee by Starbucks and then this is like my favorite creamer of all time I just keep repurchasing it because it's so good you guys need to try it if you haven't um, so that is gonna be my breakfast for today I also started taking my prenatals in the mornings because um, I think I missed a day I can't remember when but I ended up taking it in the morning the following day and now I just take it in the mornings um, and it's like all discolored and stuff because I threw this in a bag when we went to Disneyland with a bunch of other medicine and it leaked so yeah there's like I don't know maybe 10 or so left in here so I need to buy some more of them I got them off of gosh I forget um, shoot why can't I think oh Vitacost that's where I got these from um so yeah filming this right now is gonna force me to go online right now and purchase some more because I'm gonna run out soon I'm looking up from my window sun's coming up like the day before you're like a stone on my pillow I don't make a sound when I shut the door To 
we can spend all day in bed. I'll put the TV in the room. We'll have a Netflix marathon. KG saxophone. We'll order in a bunch of food. I'll put your favorite. Okay, we need to leave here in the next like 10 minutes or so to go pick up Bailey from preschool, but I'm starting to get hungry, so I'm gonna eat one of these bars that I showed in my last vlog. They're really good. I got them at Costco. They're this bar saves lives is what they're called, and I get the cherry and dark chocolate flavor. So I'm gonna eat this as a snack before we go get Bailey, and then I'll probably have like another big glass of water too. It's about 12.45. The girls are down for nap, and I'm starting to get really hungry. Um, so I think this is what I'm gonna have for lunch today. <clears throat> they're stuffed peppers. We had these for dinner last night. They're really good, they're from Costco. Um, so I think I'm gonna have two of them, probably the red one and a yellow one. Put some sour cream, salsa, and I think that's it on top. And that'll be my lunch for today. I've been loving this vanilla chai lately, so I'm probably gonna have like a small little glass of this but it does have quite a bit of protein in there. I don't know, is seven grams a lot? Adam could tell me, I don't know. But I don't really get a lot of protein in my diet, so I'm gonna have a little bit of this, probably half of what's left in the container, and then like another big glass of water for lunch. Okay, wow, two was definitely way too much. I could barely finish the second one. These are so filling, I tried my best, but that's all I'm eating of my lunch today. I finished my um, chai drink and I have like a couple sips left of my water, but that's all I could eat. Okay, it's three o'clock now and Shay is still napping. I might end up waking her up here in a minute because if she sleeps like any later than 3.30, she's not gonna wanna go down for bed at 7.30. So um, yeah, I might have a snack right now. I'm getting kind of hungry. But what I really want right now, you guys, is Bahama Bucks. I have been craving the pineapple dream smoothie that Adam got the other day when we went with the girls. But I also really want a cookies and cream shake from Chick-fil-A. I do not know which one I want to end up getting. But I have a feeling I'm going to be loading up the kids in the car to go get one of those two things. I had the cookies and cream Chick-fil-A shake yesterday and the day before, actually. Um, so I think I'm kind of leaning towards Bahama Bucks, but... I'll keep you posted. At this point in the day is usually when my diet takes a turn for the worst. <laughs> so I think I'm gonna snack on this. I got this like, I don't know, sometime around Easter. And it's really good. It's like a, I don't know, like a super sweet trail mix. It's called the Magic Sprinkle Trail Mix. I got it from Target. But it has like candy corn in there and I don't even know what else. It's really good. So. Yeah, this is what I'm gonna be snacking on until I have to go wake up Shay. I got a couple of these drinks at Target about a week ago, and this is the last one that's in the fridge, and I don't want it to go bad, so I'm gonna drink this. It has celery, apple, kale, and ginger in it. It's like six minutes later, and I'm having some of these Starbursts. A lot of you guys are like shook that there's even Starbursts left in this jar, and honestly, I am too. We eat them pretty much every single day. But I'm gonna have these three right now. Okay, we're pulling up to Bahama Bucks right now. I love that they have a drive-thru. <laughs> you want one too, Shay? You guys have no idea how excited I am for this right now. I just got a strawberry dream, a medium strawberry dream smoothie, and then I got the girls a strawberry bliss. But um, I'm gonna have them, or I did have them, separate it into two small like kids cups so that it's filled halfway. And Bailey, what did you request? An umbrella and a cherry. Yes, and a rainbow. She wants a rainbow smoothie. They don't have that here, so I just got her a strawberry bliss. Okay, I've already guzzled down like a quarter of this, but it's so good. Definitely hit the spot, and I have a feeling I'm gonna be living at Bahama Bucks like all summer. Okay, it's a lot later now. I just finished putting both the girls to bed, and now I'm gonna get started on cooking dinner. And again, this is what I'm having for dinner tonight. The Santa Fe Creamy Steak Penne Pasta from Home Chef. Um, Home Chef has 18 weekly menu options, which is twice as many as Blue Apron and Home Chef. And all of their all of their recipes are like super easy to follow. And you guys know I'm not the best chef in the kitchen. Um, so even for me, like all of these recipes are super easy to follow. And typically, like this point in the night, I'm like so exhausted and cooking is the last thing that I want to do. But Home Chef's recipes just make it like really exciting to like cook and get in the kitchen and make a healthy yummy meal 
So I'm gonna make this. I just laid out all of the ingredients. I pulled out the bag from the fridge. Everything is pre-measured for you, which is my favorite part. How cute is this? Like all the little corn is just perfectly measured in there for me so I won't have to waste any ingredients. And then um, I pulled out the steak for the pasta as well. So now I'm gonna get started on step one and get to cooking. Okay, so here's the finished product. It looks interesting, but it looks good. Definitely not something that we've ever tried before. No. Adam got home just in time to have dinner with me. Is it good? Yeah? Awesome. <laughs> home Chef is rated number one in customer satisfaction though, so that says something, and I have never tried a meal from them that I haven't liked. But if you guys wanna check out Home Chef, you can click the link in the description box to get $20 off your first four boxes for a total of $80 off. That's the best discount that Home Chef has ever offered, so take advantage of that. And thanks to Home Chef for sponsoring today's video. Okay, it's like 10 o'clock, but I'm craving something sweet per usual. And we don't really have very much. So I'm gonna have one of these popsicles and call it a night. I normally have at least something sweet before I go to bed after dinner. Um, and I would not be surprised if I have like a bowl of cereal later. Um, but I need to export this footage so that I can start editing it so that you guys can have it for tomorrow morning. So I'm going to end the vlog here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you guys very soon. Bye.